Welcome to another episode of Tinkering Experiments. In this episode, we will be trying to smooth out our PLA print with muriatic acid. Muriatic acid is essentially hydrochloric acid but in a less pure form. The muriatic acid here is diluted with water so it's a roughly 50 to 50 ratio. We'll drop the print in and see if it reacts right away or if it requires some time. Hmm. It seems like this print I picked is too big to actually fit into the mason jar. I guess we'll just have to switch it to a smaller print. I don't see anything happening so far. There's no fizzing, so I'm guessing the print's not oxidizing or anything, or being melted. So I guess we'll just have to leave it in here for a while and see if it actually affects the PLA. I left it inside for like 5 days now. Let's see if it did anything. I'll wash it and then we can take a look at it. I can still see the layers and feel them. I don't see any surface finish or difference at all. Maybe we diluted the acid too much. Here's a side comparison to one that wasn't exposed to muriatic acid. Visually, they look completely the same and they feel identical to the touch as well. Well, there we have it. We tried to smooth out our PLA print with muriatic acid and it looks like it just doesn't work. I was very hopeful as muriatic acid is a very strong acid, but maybe we diluted it a bit too much. We'll have to try the experiment again, but with more concentrated muriatic acid. Before I end, I just want to remind everyone about Tinkering U. The platform has a lot of teaching resources on 3D printing and it can also help you incorporate it into your curriculum. So be sure to check it out. That's the end of our experiment. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up. And if you did not, then a thumbs down below. Remember to subscribe and comment on what experiments you would like to see in the future. Thank you for watching. Tinker out.